What up guys, Johnny here. Uh, in this video we're going to be going and taking on the Moonlight Butterfly, or we'll get right before him, and then do that boss one in a different video, just for anyone that's looking, just for that boss video. Makes it easier on them. So there would be a demon, <laughs> uh, prowling demon, I'm not sure what they call him, I think it's prowling demon, in that room, right where I was standing, if you hadn't killed it already like I did earlier. And these tree guys are pretty easy, <laughs> I can hit them, I unblocked too early. So we're just going to run around a bit. Uh, to the right over here is another area you can go to, but we won't be doing that until we come back here later on. Getting some more poison healing items. Get out of my way, stupid rock. What are you doing? Why are you blocking me with this small piece of rock? Okay, kill on this tree, and if you notice there's one behind us that pops out of the ground once you uh, walk to a certain spot. So watch out for that. You can drop the blooming purple moss clump. That's a pretty good item. I think it costs a thousand souls to buy one of those. Heals toxic. So to open this shiny door over here, you actually have to buy the key from the blacksmith for 20,000 souls, or you could kill him and he gets it, but I wouldn't recommend that unless you're doing some kind of speedy run, and won't we'll really want to be using him. And there's this bonfire right here behind that hidden wall, you just gotta attack that, and then you have access to it. Oh, it looks like I missed an item back there. There's another item over there on a the ledge, and we'll be getting that later on. Then you want to run down this path to the right of that door, and there's a fog door up here. And there's some trees in here. I think it's a trap, because <laughs> I don't think they go until you pick up the item. And it's not even that good of an item. And then, but after you do that, when you run by here later on, I think they'll be aggroed automatically. Bloodred Moss Clump. I don't think I've ever used one of those except for trading it to Hartley the Crow, Snowy the Crow, whatever its name is. <laughs> and these guys are. I'm not gonna say they're pretty easy because they probably own me. But you do combustion on them twice and they're dead. Mm, somehow my combustion missed. Oi, they both hit me. And I got owned. Oops, someone's calling me. I'm gonna pause this video for a second. Alright guys. I got owned by this guy apparently. <laughs> That's alright. I got to die sometime, man. I can't never die. I'm supposed to die in this game. And I think I will be showing how to go about killing these guys. <laughs> Just run around and aggro them all. Oh, this guy's pretty easy. The tree starts hitting me from behind. Oh, cool. Drink up. Drink, 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 drink. There's a couple items in here. Oh, this one. Ooh. Maybe armor. Don't think I'll be using that. I'm just running around aggroing most of these guys. And then let me just turn around and fight them one more time basically. So there's that tree on the left. <laughs> I just saw it right there. 
I'll be looking for that later on and be like, where is it? But I'll show it to you guys in the next video. Just takes it to another path with a couple items, not really anything fantastic. Oh, I think it does take it to get the poise ring, or a ring that increases your poise resistance. A wolf ring or something like that. So this guy's doing an attack right now that makes it so you can't roll and you walk really slow. <laughs> I'm still block though, so I can take him on no problem. I'm not sure if that would be hurting your stamina a lot more if you don't have your shield upgraded or not. Picking up a couple more items and this tree's trying to get me. Combustion, yeah, you're dead. What now? I see another guy. This guy's giving you, what, 300 souls? They do drop a stone greatsword, or maybe even their shield. Which, uh, I'm not sure if that stone greatsword is on the item list of the rare items you can get. Ooh, an item. Huh, they trapped me. Partisan. Never even tried that one. These little snake guys on the tree here will sometimes drop an uh, item that heals. Uh, egg head, or if you get infested by eggs, so that's somewhat useful. So you can be able to equip a helmet again. Like here, I run all the way around and go right by it. It's funny, the tree's right there. Where am I going? It's right there. <laughs> I missed it. You can attack that tree, and it leads you to another path. But I show that in the next video. I know because I already played the next video. I'm recording this afterwards, if you guys did not notice that. I did actually record it while I was, record audio while I was playing, but for some reason, it did not record. Getting stuck. Ooh, one more guy chasing me. Don't really need to fight these guys. I mean, you can just come in here and run by everything in here. There was nothing really great to get. You can get some stone armor. But, uh, ugh, you can get some stone armor, but I'm not going to be using that anyway. And am I going to die again? That would suck. Man, yeah, these guys are pretty easy once you hit them twice. Ooh, there's that stone great sword. I uh, didn't even look at it. I don't look at it in the next video either. So maybe I'll take a peek at it in the video after that. But uh, we're going to make another video for the boss fight, like I said. So I will be seeing you guys next time.